Meghan Markle needs to come up with the content as children's book was a flop. Meghan Markle's children's book The IDNT get anywhere near the best-selling list in the UK although Americans continue to favor the Duchess. Meghan Markle's illustrated book for young children, The Bench, was branded a flop by a Today host. The Duchess released the 169-word book on June 8, 2021 but was met with disappointing sales as the book WASNT a bestseller in the UK. The Bench was inspired by Prince Harry's relationship with the couple's son Archie Harrison. Today host Alison Langdon said, Meghan Markle plans to create a new animated kids show, we know her book was a flop, it WASNT a bestseller was it. Royal expert Russell Myers replied, certainly not in the UK, it didnt get anywhere near the best-selling list, however the Americans have flopped in their droves to buy it, that just tells you about the couple's popularity. They're at rock bottom here in the UK, I'm not too sure they're so in Australia but in the US they seem to be continuing to be flavor of the month. However, for a 169-word book, I don't think it can be turned into a motion picture anytime soon, so I'm not too sure we'll be seeing it on Spotify or Netflix. Meghan Markle in Italy wrote the poem as a gift for Prince Harry on his first Father's Day. The book is centered around a father-son relationship and the bond they form in the early years of a child's life, told from the perspective of the mother. Artist Christian Robinson illustrated the book with a series of watercolor paintings. Although the book failed to perform in the bestseller list, it was praised for its diversity as Robinson featured a wide range of families from different ethnicities and backgrounds. Due to her pregnancy and the arrival of the couple's daughter Lilibet on June 4, Meghan made no PR appearances to promote her book. The Duchess announced her latest project with Netflix last week, an animated children's series that she will help create and executive produce. Titled Pearl, the series will follow a 12-year-old girl on heroic adventures as she interacts with influential women throughout history. She will produce the series alongside David Furnish, the husband of Elton John and a close family friend. In a statement, the Duchess said, like many girls her age, our heroine Pearl is on a journey of self-discovery as she tries to overcome life's daily challenges. I'm thrilled that Archwell Productions, partnered with the powerhouse platform of Netflix, and these incredible producers, will together bring you this new animated series, which celebrates extraordinary women throughout history. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle signed a deal with Netflix in September 2020 that is estimated to be worth £100 million. In their tell-all interview with Oprah Winfrey, the couple said they committed to deals with Netflix and Spotify after becoming financially cut off from the royal family after Megshee. 